In this recording, this is obviously Kulumang question two, a question on AMA vectors from this November 2016 question paper. Uh, in the description box of this video, Uzotola AMA links for other questions for this question paper. Lago question two, but a heavy object is lifted using two ropes. Now I'm a rope, rope. These ropes are used to lift this object. And two pulleys. So lama ropes lawa are hanging over lama pulleys lawa. As shown in the diagram below. The two pull the two pulleys are a distance x apart. The force A FA in rope A is 713 newtons and the force and the force FB in rope B is 1440 newtons. Rope A makes an angle of 70 degrees with the horizontal and rope B makes an angle of 10 degrees with the vertical. Now, um, all right, again. Yeah. So lago 2.1, but it defined the term resultant vector. So a resultant vector is just the sum of two or more vectors, right? It's a resultant. So a resultant developed by adding or summing up two or more vectors. That's the definition of a resultant vector. 2.2, Martin Gela. Explain why the vector diagram of force F1 and for force FB and the weight will not be a closed vector diagram. Okay, the secret lies here again. A heavy object, um, a heavy object at this corner, a heavy object, right? A heavy object, in Funuk underline the statement, list. a heavy object is lifted right the heavy object is what is lifted right so it won't be a closed vector diagram since the object is not stationary but instead it is being what is being lifted so a mover upward now mover upward it means in the vertical plane the resultant force the resultant vector is non-zero so if that's the case I you could tell a closed vector diagram i'm a closed vector diagram so i told her if and only if i'm a if vector in a given system is equal to zero horizontally and vertical um so in this case since the object is a mover upward or is over lifted so singati um explain why like 2.2 singati the object is not stationary or the object is lifted upward so it's because of inzani yeah move 2.3 2.3.1 calculate the vertical component of f1 so for now the vertical component of f1 which is this component this component this vertical component is facing up because of the um the applied force or the tension force f1 is acting upward at a inclined nothing the f1 is applied at an angle of 70 degrees and upward so the vertical component is of facer upward if the vet if the comp if the applied force was going down therefore f y way to be as opaque upon since the vet the, the f the f a is pointing up at this angle of 70 degrees it means the vertical component now is of facer in the upward direction so the vertical component of fa is facing up and a check argument lana lana this this vertical component is a former a 90 degree angle with the horizontal so apply as a seven trigonometric ratios for calculating fy so guzoba and guzoba the fy is opposite to 70 degrees so if you want to sign 70 degrees equal to fy which is the component thing if you divided by fa the hypotenuse of this triangle so therefore by cross multiplying you told fy is equal to 
FA times sine 70 degrees, right? Now, we substitute again. FA is 730 sine 70 degrees, right? So using a calculator now to find the answer here to Lana, so the answer here to is equal to 730 times sine 70 degrees is equal to 685.78.78, right? In two decimal places. So our answer lies equal to this. Now, see how go 2.3.2. We want the horizontal component of FA. I think Lungi said this thing. I don't know what happened, but I think Lungi is. All right, now I apologize for that. Now, let's be like back to another horizontal component of FA. We want the horizontal component. So the horizontal component is so FX, right? This is 2.3.2, .2, the horizontal component of FA. Straightforward denial. Lana, what are we looking for? So for now, Fx, which is the adjacent side to 70 degrees. So is it cos 70 degrees is equal to Fx adjacent divided by Fa. Divided by Fa, which is the hypotenuse. Therefore, divide down one and cross multiply and make Fa the subject of the form. Wait, fx, the subject of the formula, fx is over equal to fa times co 70 degrees, right? And then see a substitute again. My substitute uh, wow, seven, uh, 730 co 70 degrees. So, lana sizoti cancel co 70 degrees is equal to 249.67 in two decimal places. So our answer la is over equal to 249.67 newtons, yes. <clears throat> so this is the horizontal component. Now 2.4, go 2.4, but you calculate the maximum weight that force A and force B will be able to lift from the ground. Um, show all calculations. Hmm, okay. Uh, for no combis the maximum weight, right? The maximum weight that force A and force B will be able to lift from the ground, right? So bagaj. The vertical components of FA and FB you as a snet or this calculator uh would this calculator this this maximum weight, right? Since the object is going to be lifted upwards, the, the vertical components, the components as well are a roller. So, these things are the vertical component for UFB girl, right? I will need the vertical component for FB first. So, 2.4, 2.4, this one is here. F Y component for force B is equal to F B times the sine 70 degrees. Since this is the F Y is the vertical component for Barney for F B. The vertical component is calculate calculating sine 70 degrees times the hypotenuse, which is the um, F B force equal to FB is 1440 times sine 70 degrees, right? Times 70 degrees. I spoke this tall again. 1440 times sine 70 degrees. Our answer is equal to 13 uh, sine 70. It's 1353.15. Hey, wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? It's not 70 degrees, love. Why? <laughs> okay. Lana, it's 10 degrees. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I think it's so. Let me explain. Let me explain, Lana. Uh, here. 
right na le na le triangle le yeso isebenzisa to calculate the vertical component so i need the angle yala right the 10 degrees and the angle yala ngifunayo na ngahlanganisa this angle and the 10 degrees must give me what 90 degrees so it means the angle yala it's it's 80 degrees uh, it's 90 degrees minus 10 degrees is what it's 80 degrees so i need this angle to find ubani u f y so this angle is 80 degrees lana so give about 80 degrees 80 degrees <coughs> 80 degrees just like google triangle we had an angle 70 degrees so now calculator lana i thought hey going it's 70 degrees which i was wrong by the way so the angle yalana in this triangle is 80 degrees 90 degrees minus 10 is 80 degrees right makes sense yes 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 i hope so 144 zero times sine 80 degrees now is equal to 148 141 one two newtons right one two newton so umang abe ng pula le string less or le rope nang pula le rope le eh ng buyang pula na le rope le the vertical components of these forces are the ones responsible for lifting the object up right so because of still na ma loganchi na ma ropes la they can only handle much right ang yega likey if ever uzo tata maybe i truck u to lift a u lift a truck ngala ma rope obviously la ma rope azo fail azo snap right so there's that maximum amount la ma rope sanga khona ku lift we want that maximum weight or maximum amount of weight that the the, the ropes can lift and then the magic is go igupi igla ma vertical components so therefore the maximum weight that the ropes can lift the max weight is equal to the maximum weight is equal to uh, f y component yaga bani yaga a now it's like is an f y component yaga b i get what the maximum weight right uh, so f y a it's this one is that we call uh, it's this one f y six Six point six eight five comma nine eight plus FYB one four one eight comma one two. Therefore, nang e talana is a tola what six eight five point nine eight plus one four one eight comma one two. This is equal to two thousand one hundred and four point one one thousand wait two thousand two thousand one hundred and four comma one comma one newton. So this is the maximum amount of weight that the ropes can lift. Anything or oh, anything above the amount le, this maximum weight le. Lama ropes as a fail, meaning as a snare palama luganch lama ropes. So yeah, two point four Pelelala two point five. Explain why the rope and the pulley system will be less effective if the distance between the pulleys is increased. Why as of why why the system angege ibe effective? That's the question ge much. Okay, nanga bing increase our x, it has good the pulley is over la, and then this pulley is over somewhere la, right? And then what what's going to happen is that this is over na something like this, and then nga passive na something like this, right? And then na rope yami, na rope yamga la right so it's why it's because of in increasing the distance now among increase the distance le, what's going to happen is that i'm a vertical components warm as well as we increase so the vertical components will do what will in um 
Ah, no, 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 no. Pegala. This one, this vertical component or vertical vector is higher than this one, right? Pega. Or nangi increase angi later somewhere la we have a decrease of the vertical component. Yes, they are not increasing but doing what? Decreasing, right? So nanga would decrease a lama loga angela lama vertical components. It becomes difficult to go to lift any form of weight using lama ropes la, right? So imagine a pulley system here to be so much. Imagine, just imagine. Now your object here to la. You increase the distance x to such an extent that kuba sort of like a kuba sort of like a straight line yana so instead go tick form ege some way like la nsha bona go easy go thing pull it down pull it down e la and then pega ke much the distance x say much greater than the one than this one give much yeah one so if you increase a feather was always over a straight line so therefore what difficult to go to in zeni we lift the object because of in journey um it's sort of like lama ropes are a former sort of like a straight nyana line so so what difficult it's because of lama vertical components are decrease allow and then if i decrease i go about difficult or Uba difficult or sort of or, or even impossible good to lift the le object yako. So that's the reason as I provide a lagu 2.5. But our question ipele la lagu 2.5. Um this was a question on ama vectors in the description box. Please check it out. Dunga tola ama also tola ma links for other questions on pendulile for this question paper. For now, um um, just like the video, just leave a comment. Nangabune, nangabune question. Um, share na bangan ba ako nangabutole some value out of this video. Nangabu new to this channel, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. Asbona and do the next.